how you live it? I'm chilling, I'm chilling. It's Tony Miles, the smoothest nigga alive. Oh, uh -huh. Hell yeah. <laughs> we just took a shot. We just popped this bottle of Frankly Organic. It is the strawberry lemonade. Well, this shit is busted. I'm not even gonna hold you. This shit really good, especially chilled. It's really good, and I don't drink like that. So we gotta take a shot real quick, okay? That's really good. All right. So you told me that you from the Bronx. No, you're not from the Bronx. I live in the Bronx. Oh yes, you live in the Bronx. You're from Florida, right, right, right. Yeah. Where does Uptown start? Uh huh. That's funny. That's funny. Um. Damn, I feel like, at least to me, I feel like Uptown small. Uptown is like right after, like, 180th and up. Yeah. Cause like everything else, it just it, like once you transition over, that shit look different. It feel different. Pretty much. Yeah. Pretty much. Like one, one, 180 West Palms and shit like that. It feel like South Bronx shit. Yes. Like it don't it don't look like Uptown. When you go Uptown, it got like a whole. It's no, I don't I don't know. Uptown got like a blend. Of like like fancy shit and like like hood shit, but like it 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 never looked too much like like South Bronx. Like okay. you can see the transition of that shit. Right. Yeah. I don't go to the Bronx. For real? I'm scared of the Bronx. Why? Don't take me in the Bronx. You said who? They. Them. Them? Them. All of them? Or just some of them? Most of them. Most of them? Yeah. Don't take me. I'm cute. <laughs> don't take me. Shit, they, I wanna they, come they, back home. I wanna come down here. I'll be I'll be in Brooklyn, damn near every other day. I'll be taking a trip. It's like an hour and a half. Hey. It's you know it's okay. You know shit. I like Brooklyn, and I might I was thinking about moving out here because it's convenient. Cause yeah. I'll be out here so a much. Lot of stuff happens here. There's not many events that happen up in the Bronx. Uh, I got I got people that's trying to they're trying to change that. They're trying to make sure yeah. like like yo the Bronx is like as lit as Brooklyn right now. It's gonna take a lot more people though, cause it's I like, agree. yeah. But that's what I'm saying. That's why I won't go to the Bronx, cause they won't put, they won't even put events right. in the Bronx. You probably right. pretty scared yeah. to go there. So once your people start getting shit moving, let me know. I'll go. I mean, we we got a couple things. We got some every Sunday and shit. It's like a, okay. it's like a game day slash okay. performance shit. So like you know, that. yeah, you know they trying to get creative and that's shit. Cool. Hell yeah. Where are you from in Florida? Fort Lauderdale. What made you come up here? I was forced. Okay. Yeah, it was. It was, was it a good thing or a bad thing? Now that you're here and settled. Personally, I want to go back home. Okay. Like, like I can't be up here. This is not yeah. it. Like, you know, like I'm, I'm used to seeing fucking, fucking. I'm, I'm okay with being in a lake that got alligators in that shit. Okay. I'm content. Yeah. This city shit, like, it's cool. Yeah. Like we travel and it's shit different. like that. I've been here long enough, so it's like I'm, I'm, I kind of got used to it, but I never got like I never accepted it. Like it's still kind of like it's I'm just here. Kind of, sort of. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm just here. Like I feel like I'm like I'm not in it. I'm like just like amongst it type of shit. Yeah. Yeah. I hear that. But, you so know, how's your music taking off here? Oh, it's funny you say that, cause like me being amongst it. That's when I started going outside a lot. Like I wasn't going outside like that before. Yeah. So I started going outside and like, like before, like before I started going outside, this shit was slow. I'm going outside. I'm start meeting hella people and shit like right. that. Like that's the one thing I give New York. You go outside enough, you see everybody. everybody yeah. They be like, yo, you go on the train to see different people. If you on the train every day right. and going to every world, you gonna recognize some people. Of course, and shit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like some random ass people, like them. I seen you on the train at nine o'clock in the morning and shit like that. Like two months later, I get on nine o'clock in the morning, the same train. Yeah. There you is again. Yeah. So at like, I love that. Like when you outside, you start to see at least a pattern and shit, and you start to embrace and like attract people and shit and the energies and shit like that. Hell yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I, I I give New York that. New York, when you go outside. It's, it's fun to come outside. I love outside. Yeah, I'm from yeah. Connecticut. I'm not from here, so I really? yeah, so I'm here all the time. Girl, what you doing in Connecticut? Oh shit. Ain't shit, cause I'm here, right? <laughs> right. You right, you right. I be born in Connecticut. Connecticut ain't, born. ain't shit to do in Connecticut. No. I had the option to move there and I'm like, no. No, 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 no. 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 I'm glad you're here though. I'm glad you're here. You'll, yeah. you'll be you'll benefit more from being here than being yeah. in Connecticut. Sorry, Connecticut, but that's just a god on the truth. No, I don't gotta apologize to Connecticut. Who the <laughs> Ain't nobody in Connecticut. I want to move out here, so. There's more shit for me here than. Yeah. The 
money though. Yeah, but that's why you gotta make money. more money. You gotta be outside more so you can make more money. Yeah, but like, at least in Connecticut, we still got like. You gotta bang for your buck. Yeah. yeah. That and, I agree with for sure. Cause mind you, I, I live on my own in the Bronx. Oh wow. It's like my whole check gone when I get it. Yeah, like, just yeah. to rent. Just to rent. I definitely understand oh, that. Gosh. I don't want to be an adult no more. Oh, yeah, talk about, about it. Fuck adulting. Okay, so talk to me about your music. Oh, right? How can we define your music in three words? If you were to introduce your music to somebody, how would you define it? Smoothest nigga alive. <laughs> Honestly, especially, especially with, because I've only dropped one song this year. Oh, wow. But my one song was the transition into like, you know, when you gotta take a step back and like reinvent. Yeah. It was it, this was the song that I decided to reinvent with. Okay. And I didn't release none. I've been I've been creating hella shit. Yeah. But I only released one of them. You gonna see it later on. That, You're performing. Oh hell yeah, girl. Uh, how do you feel? Shit. Oh, I mean, I like regular. Like this is like I wanna say I don't wanna I don't wanna be like I'm exaggerating, but like. Only because I lost count. I want to say maybe this is like my 70th, 70th show oh, wow. this whole year or some shit. Wow. Yeah, so like for the event, like yeah, I'm excited about it. Because I like I like shit like this. I like when people, yeah, like shit like you this. You had I a love good crowd. Shit. Yeah. Casey knows how to put on a good crowd for sure. Hell yeah. How'd you find out about the come up experience? Um, Jason Lee, uh, the Stella Connect, I'm, I'm cool with them. Okay. And she was like, yo. She's like, yo, this is, this is like, get in this shit. Yeah. And I'm like, like, personally, whenever she, whenever she got ideas, I try to listen. Yeah. Cause she don't sit around and just be like, yeah. think about fuck shit. Yeah, comes from the heart. Yeah, absolutely, that too. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't, like, I'm I already, I already seen Casey at a couple shows, but I didn't know her personally. Yeah. So I don't think that would have been enough for me to get in this motherfucker. For sure. Yeah. No, I yeah. Said, Casey's good people though. Oh no, oh, definitely. Real, for real. Definitely. Once you like it with Casey, you like it for life with Casey. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Once, I, once I actually like, like started speaking to her, I'm like, yo, like she, she got it already yeah. and shit like that. Hell yeah. She got this shit on last. She know what she doing. Hell yeah, yeah. Yo, take, she get a W. That's, Shout out to Casey. Uh, we gotta take a yeah. shot for Casey. Take a shot. Come on. Whichever one you want. You mix it, you crazy. Shit. Whichever. Fuck okay. It. Fuck it. I love that. Source my smooth exclusive. You have to give me an exclusive. What's your exclusive? My exclusive, um, shit. My project, uh, uh, it's not even done yet or nothing like that. So I'm, I'm probably telling y'all hella, uh, hella earlier shit. Pardon me, but I am not your type. That is a project. It got 16 songs on the motherfucker. Right now it might change and shit. It might get less. You know how artists be. They be like, yo. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. So right now I got 16 songs and shit like that, and it's the most authentic shit that I can release. Okay. I didn't, I didn't, I don't want to say I didn't think about none of it, but I didn't try right. to put like I didn't overthink. Yeah. I was just, which is a, you know, which is key. yes, because I be overthinking on a motherfucker. Yeah. So I'm like, you know what? Let me it's just. It's hard. You just gotta let it do what it does. That's exactly what I did, and it came. I'm usually skeptical and like, like, like I critique myself too much. Yeah. This time I, I love everything I made. I'm lying. But I, <laughs> I love damn near everything I made. And what I didn't love, I took it off. So this is just the shit that I love so much that I was like, yo, I gotta keep it. I love that. Yeah, yeah. I'm very excited to hear that. Thank you for the exclusive. Oh, of course. Thank of course you for sitting down with me from Florida to Connecticut uh, to New York to the Bronx. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We said it went live. Thank you so much for staying with me. Shout out to Casey, Stella Experience. We all here. Shout out to you, girl. You got it all locked right now. Yo, you're bad! <laughs> <laughs> Shut up a little bit. Hey.